What is up guys, this is Cuboac here, and welcome back to yet another episode. For the last two weeks, all these videos you have been seeing of Twilight Princess were all recorded on Saturday the 22nd. And this video should be going up into October. So, I'm sorry for bulk recording so far in advance, it's just what I do because I try not to record after work every single day because that's when... I feel like I have two jobs, and I don't want YouTube to feel like a job, I want it to feel like a hobby, so I play it on my weekends, and when I feel like recording, I record. And the weekends are usually that time, so the weekends I reserve, like, hey, I'm not doing anything anyways, I'll just schedule it into my schedule, I won't do anything during the day, I'll just record. And I usually have fun, because I absolutely love the games I'm playing right now, so it's, it's a jolly good time. A jolly good time. My tongue is a little numb because that hot pocket I just ate kind of burnt it. All right, let's get out of here. Last time we finished the lake bed temple, and now we are about to enter what I believe is the next chapter of Zelda. The next dungeon could be, though, what we use the infused shadows for. So I could be completely wrong. This could not. Considering they're asking me if I want to save Something is about to happen something big We're back here uh. What what My boy Zant! No, not my boy Zant. Zant is not my boy. Don't tell me he just did it again. I was loving how beautiful everything was. And Zant literally just smacked me back to wolf and... No! <clears throat> Did you honestly mean to take an ancient and withered power like this and turn it against me? You are a foolish traitor, Minna. Why do you defy your king? <laughs> My king? You? Who did nothing but abuse the magic of your tribe? You must be joking. How dare you? Are you implying that my power is our old magic? Now that is a joke. Ah! Oh! This power is granted to me by my god. It is the magic of the King of Twilight and you overspect it. <laughs> My Midna, did you forget? That beast is one of the light dwellers who oppressed our people. No matter how much you may desire otherwise, you'll never be more than a shadow in their world. You cannot consort with their kind. But if we can make their world ours, Midna, light and darkness will meet at last. Our tribe will take back their realm, and sweet darkness will blot out this harsh light. And that Midna is why. I need you. Not just for me, but for all of our people. Lend me your power. So be it. I will return you to the light world, you covet. Ah! Uh, 
What are you doing? Look at his shoes, though. Nice. Wait, is Midna actually... We're in the light, but we're a wolf. Oh man. And she oh my god. Kubo, hero chosen by the goddesses. I don't know who this is speaking. Go to the princess locked away in the castle. That princess holds the key that can unlock you from your shadow form. Zelda, we're coming for you right now. The music What is this? I feel like we just entered the realm of the dead! I don't wanna- They shouldn't have battle theme right now. It's kind of ruining the mood. But I'm saving Midna. Because Ganon- Or not Ganon, Zant! Might be Ganon, we don't know yet. Zant put her into the realm of light without her becoming that shadow. Like, her actual form is right now where it cannot be sustained. And the music is incredible. I'm gonna look up the name of this, this piano. But it's Nintendo, so it's gonna have a lot of copyright on it. I can't use that in anything else. Like, I'm fine if my Nintendo videos getting claimed, but... I don't want to get all my videos claimed for using some Nintendo pianics. I just realized everybody could see me as a wolf right now. What was that? Pick up this bone. <laughs> They're afraid of me. I have to get past them somehow. Alright, where is there another way around? Can I get on the walls? Let's take a look. I still don't know what the clocks are, I never found out. I think I just have to use this bone somehow. Oh wait. Might be able to dig somewhere. Okay, I have to find another way in. Need to find another way in. Hold on. 
Okay. Let's see, can I get in over here? <gasps> I can talk to the cat! I just hate the rain, I can't get comfortable whether I sit or stand. Maybe my sixth sense is trying to tell me something. See, that was my key. My cue. To hit this. Is a cat following me over here? Or is there a dog over here or something? There it is. It's really coming down. At this rate, today's meeting will be cancelled. Today's meeting? Do I have to use the animals to my advantage? I think I have to use these animals to my advantage. Oh, hello. This is my f your first time in this town. I'm looking for someone named Luis. She's supposed to know this town well. Where's the bar? The bar. Here we go. Wow, you didn't stop me at all. I don't think I was supposed to go this way. I think that just... What the heck are you? That was a Poe? The Poe's in this game are intense, bro! Dude, I'm really gonna record way too many episodes in this session. I'm gonna bulk record like this entire game because I'm so involved right now. <gasps> Wait, she's gonna know. I have to go. I have to go right now because this chick, this woman, what's her name? What's her name? I totally forget her name. The bartender chick. She is going to be the key. What is her name? I feel bad. Telma. I was thinking Zelma, but Telma. She's gonna know. Beast, get out! Oh no. You there! Oh, it's a fat cat! <gasps> it's her cat! I knew the cat was important! Yes! You're Cubo, correct? <laughs> I'm gonna give him th or her this super. Oh, oh. Hmm, yes, I thought so. I could just tell, you know. I'm Luis. Do you remember meeting me in the shop before? Though I don't think we were really properly introduced. In any case, I must tell you, I'm a bit puzzled as to why you look like that. Really, dear, you can't blame the humans for tossing you out the way you look. Oh, another patient. You certainly are a curious sort. Please, please. Princess Zelda. This way. Oh, because she said. That's why she said the bar had a secret entrance to the castle. Here, get in through the window. The attic is connected to the castle. It's an old waterway, though, so it could be a rough trip. Well, I suppose that's left to do is make sure you humans don't notice you. No, can I push this? I feel like I need to push this. Yeah. Because Midna's not helping me jump anywhere right now. She's dying. Xant is insane, bro. The way his mouth is cut and whatnot, though. Ugh. Oh my god, there's Glorons and everything in here, huh? I don't want to listen to anyone down there. I probably should, but I'm not going to. I'm surprised Toma. I felt like Toma would be like, oh no! I know it's you, Kubo! But nope. Had to be the cat. What is this nonsense? <clears throat> Got another post soul. I feel like you're important. Oh, thanks for beating the ghost. Can I call you doggy? 
I'm Giovanni. I became consumed by greed long ago and sold my soul to the creature that did this to me. I can't move. I can't go see my girlfriend. My pet cat, Gangle, is frozen on my head. I don't think I could be more miserable. I have to ask a favor, doggy. Can you go defeat 20 ghosts that lurk in the dark for me? I think if you can free the ghosts of my soul from the ghosts that hold them, I'll be free. Oh, but it's raining out now, so I don't think you can go outside directly. I'll open the door for the underground waterway for you. Look at that magic. And this is a side quest now. Once the rain stops, you can come back in here by digging around the front wall where the cats gather. Understand, doggy? Alright, sweet. We have learned. We have done our research. Let me in. There we go. Now we have to get post souls for that guy, and he's probably going to give us something worthwhile. I really wish there were not enemies that made noise. Or made the battle theme change. Okay, this kills the mood of this. Why do you not just die? There you go. Alright, give me that. I have a feeling lighting these is actually important. I missing I need that torch stick back rap, rap. get away can I climb this with this in my mouth yes I can all right there's no extra secret to that one just keep running I don't want to fight anything, because I feel like it's more dramatic if I don't. Alright. I feel like we're getting close. Oh, I probably have to go up, because... What kind of princess stays at the bottom of the castle, right? Why? Oh my god, that was annoying. That was actually very, very annoying. That was also equally as annoying. These enemies are just ruining the feel. It would have been a lot more epic if every enemy, like, you could run past in some way. Like, even if it was risky to do it that way. Oh my god. Uh, I just want to listen to the piano, man. I'm tired of the music changing with every enemy. If you could fight enemies to this piano, like this desperate sounding piano for Midna, so much better. It's like when you- ARE YOU KIDDING ME?! They're really- this whole thing right here? Of it being a... Ropes that are, like, super tedious, apparently? It's just ruining the feel for me. Cause this has a really good emotional feel going on right now. And these stupid ropes are literally ruining that for me. Nope. There we go. Thank God that dude missed. I would have been mad.
Hold on. Hey, this look familiar to anybody? <laughs> that looks like where you fight the giant bird in Wind Waker. But, okay. Why are there goblins on top of the castle? Like, why is nobody asking these questions besides me, you know? Alright. This is very reminiscent of the beginning of the game. Alright, get out. But this right here, just being able to run past every enemy on this rooftop in the rain to this music would make it freaking intense. Where do I need to go? This way? Alright! We're almost to Zelda! I'm making it to Zelda in this episode because I don't want to keep recording over and over all day. And I'm just so invested in this right now. We did it! We made it to the top of the castle! But where is Zelda? Is Midna the real Zelda? I don't think so, but it is a possibility. Nope. There she is. Please, please tell me. How do we break the curse on this one? This is the one. You need him to save your world. That's why, princess. Please, you must help Kubo. Midnight, you're breaking my heart! What binds him is a different magic than what transformed him when he first passed through the Curtain of Twilight. It is an evil power. Our world is one of balance. Just as there is light to drive away darkness, so too there is be benevolence to banish evil. Head for the sacred grove that lies deep within the lands guarded by the spirit Farron. There you will find the blade of evil's bane that was crafted by the wisdom of the ancient sages, the Master Sword. The Master Sword is a sacred blade that evil can never touch. Evil cloaks you like a dark veil, and that blade is the only thing that can cleave it. Kubo, hero sent by the goddesses. Like you, I have been granted special powers by the goddesses. Fine, Kubo, you can you can get to the woods on your own, right? Oh, my heart! Princess, I have one last request. Can you tell him where to find the mirror of twilight? She about a damn gave it to- <gasps> That's how we transform freely, the mirror of twilight, it makes so much sense! Midna, I believe I understand now just who and what you are. Despite your mortal injuries, you act in our steed. These dark times are the result of our deeds, yet it is you who I have who have reaped the penalty. Accept this now, Midna, I pass it to you. Zola's gonna die for Midna! Zelda is dying to save Midna. I'm calling it right now. This is the best let's play I think I've ever done. No, Kubo, stop her. I need these on. We go back, Kubo. Back to Farron Woods.
Did that just happen? Zelda, I've taken all you had to give, though I did not want it. Okay! There's more! Oh yeah, we could warp wherever we want, because we have Midna. Zant! <laughs> All right, can we teleport? Oh man, I gotta stop recording. This episode's getting too long. I think I might record more. I don't know what to do with my life. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like to share your support. It's very much appreciated. As always, I'm a very... I'm a wreck. Peace.